Yo, it's your boy Dark back with another video. Today we're playing some NBA 2K23 My Team. And today we'll be playing, finishing off my draft mode. I ended up playing draft mode instead of hopping into TT on online yesterday. And finishing off domination, I've done a lot actually yesterday. I played eight games of draft mode. I'll show you the team. This is the team. I didn't get a lot. I got Stephen Curry, Zach Levine, Pau Gasol. And the funny thing is, I actually finished finishing up his uh, Zach Levine. I finished up his e X Evo challenge or not Evo challenges, XP challenges, and I fin ended up finishing the dunks I needed for shooting guards. So with him, and I think I need like I'm almost done with D Stephen Curry's and Pau Gasol's limitless challenges. I just need like five more threes with him, and I think I need like four blocks for him also. So we're just gonna hop into these two games, try to get those done while we're trying to win the game also because we haven't lost the game yet surprisingly with my bad playing skills uh we finished we finally end up uh getting to the bulls and domination we already got the bulls so we got that one and in doing so playing draft mode we also got the legendary piece so the only two pieces we're missing is the one for the we're missing the michael jordan's final mvp and i think the centerpiece if i'm correct Yep, so yeah, just the championship, 1970, 1997 championship, and then Michael Jordan's final MVP. And it will be able to get Pink Diamond, Derrick Rose. So today is Thursday, if you don't know. You probably be getting this Friday morning, so that's probably why I'm saying this now. Uh, we'll, the cards we'll be getting tomorrow that I know of, I can look them up, but I'm pretty sure we're getting a Pink Diamond from Vince Carter. Uh, I think a diamond Ben Wallace, I'm pretty sure. And I think an Amethyst uh, Marcus Smart, which I I love the Ruby Amethyst. Um, or not the Ruby. Uh, yeah, the Ruby. What is this? The Ruby Marcus Smart. I love that one in last year. And it looks like the last card we're getting is... Ooh, a Zion Williamson. Pink, we're getting up three different versions. We're getting a pink diamond, a diamond, and a amethyst. And I think that's it. Yeah, we just got those four players coming in packs tomorrow. And yeah, so challenges for Don Donovan Mitchell, they've been going. We finished the ducks, like I said. We only need one more double double for Donovan Mitchell Series 1. Uh, we've been starting to get those threes after we picked up. Uh, uh, Darius, Darius Garland. We only need like 90 or more of those, which shouldn't be too hard if I just hop into TT offline. I've been mostly doing them in, uh, like skill challenges and clutch time offline, but that's it. Uh, we, we only need like 190 points for the Jazz players, which isn't too hard. And then we just need 90 something steel. So we've been getting through it, but we've mostly been doing draft mode all day yesterday and. Yeah, we, the only reason I did draft mode was to do XP and get Lamar Odom, which hasn't been going well so far. And, yeah, I mean, we just need three more players for the piece. I end, Actually, I didn't do this last video, but I ended up selling my uh, Scotty Barnes for 8500 uh, 8, 8, uh, MT. It sold. That's why I got 41K. And I ended up getting this 200 Kukoc when I hit, twenty, I think, 24 and he's actually he's actually usable even though he only got nine badges he's actually usable which the badges the only problem i have with him so far is his, his shooting and then i got this evo uh i don't know how to say his name i'm just called say jacob i, guess, I just I think it's just a different version of saying jacob but i've been evo him also just because and i also got Kawhi in here too i picked up i think i remember i picked up Kawhi instead of picking up like LeBron James or something, so I picked up Kawhi, and yeah, oh, that's another thing, I did end up, when I was leveling up, I ended up getting this PJ Armstrong, which he's actually good, if you, like, he's he's a good player, you got an 89 three ball, 92 free throw, can't dunk, but can dribble like crazy and pass, defense is okay, I mean, you don't, no 6-2 guard at this point is going to have crazy interior de or block defense can't rebound well but he's fast with ball the ball he can move 
I mean, a lot of, I wish the lot of quicks was at least like an 84, 85, but other than that, the badges are super well. Uh, yeah, like, Midi Magician, like, he has all the badges I need. I mean, I can add Agent 3 and come back hit on him, but I'm like, it's this early. I shouldn't be adding all these badges, especially since I can't sell them to get MT for him. So I'm just holding off all my badges. So that's really much it. We're just going to hop into draft mode, finish these two games, try to get Lamar Odom. And while we're doing that, we're going to try to get the, what is it called? Get the challenges done for uh, Diamond Stephen Curry and Amethyst Palkasol, because if I'm correct, yeah. I only need five more threes with Limitless Stephen Curry, and then I need four more blocks. So I was correct, and that would give me 3,000. So that automatically hit me to 25, which would, what would give me that? A Diamond Trophy case, and then hopefully we'll be super close to 26 once we're done. Because what I found, what I when I was looking at this yesterday, when you hit, I think 36, I don't know, 37, you get 75 tokens, and then when you hit 38, you get 25k. So I'm definitely gonna be hitting level 40, and then only time we would go for level 40 is because Scotty Pimpin is Scotty Pimpin. Like if you don't go for Scotty Pimpin, you're gonna be missing out. He's gonna be what he's probably gonna be on the team until like mid, like late season three, real life. Like he he probably be on the bench for the most part. I don't know. I'm about to. Ch I actually was thinking about having this, uh, getting this Hortus Grant as soon as possible, but I don't know if it's even possible for me. If I'm be honest. Let me see. Can I look up his? I can. Six ten. Got a midi. Close shot. Can dunk. He can't drive. He can't drive, but he can have a standing dunk. Defense is mediocre, if you ask me. I wish. I mean, the block is there. He can rebound, but he's super slow. That's that's the main problem for most most. Of uh, early bigs. I haven't picked up these two, and then Scotty Pimper, of course. But yeah, that's really it. So let's just hop. I'm hopping to game nine. You're not gonna see that gameplay. You're probably gonna see gameplay of ten, of game ten. So stay tuned, and I'll see you guys in a second. So here we are. We just got done with game nine. We end up going seventeen and eight before he decided to quit. So that's game nine. Easy dub. I didn't get a chance to shoot really with stuff. I got like two middies and a couple assists, but I was just trying to win the game there mostly. So let's see if we can get to the least to the top board before we get to our tenth game. If not, I just my luck is not the best here. I mean it's not a bad because then I got PJ Armstrong in the Ascension, but like if I get Lamar Odom, my power forward will be set for a while. Diamond shoe boots. Like, I, like, legit. I've been stuck on the two for like the last five, six games. And even though I've been getting tokens and MC, it's just like, thank you. There we go. Finally get the top board with six picks. Let's see. We can try to get, we can try to get the mode in here. Hopefully we can. I usually go for the corners first, so let's see. Unless they're bad, I won't go for them. 450, I'll take them. Five tokens, I'll definitely take that. The corners are looking good right now. Another five. Ooh, 10 tokens. W. Let's see. Another three. Yo, we might be able to get another. 450 or 400. Okay, so we'll take the tenth game. So how many tokens we get there? Eight, sixteen. So we got another two. We got two KMT and then diamond shooters. Sixteen tokens. So I'll take it. That's another reason why I, sh I went for it. So let's pick up. After this one, we need one more player. And then we would get that monthly quota. Or, well, no, we need three more players. Uh, so after this one, we only need these two. So that's another thing. I wanted to. I was thinking about going to Domination, just playing two games of Domination on either two of these and get the 30 tokens. Because I'll be able to get the last two. But I was like, nah, let me go for clutch time. Get a chance at some tokens. It'll be a lot easier to shoot threes in here than it is in there for Garland. And that's uh, that's what I've been doing. That's what I've been doing for the, like the last five games. 
because I don't like going in here. Like, it barely gives me anything. I get two tokens. Sometimes I get a historical piece, but... So we'll just head into let's head into the last game. I'm gonna try my best to like cut most of the unuseful and entertaining parts, but I won't make any promises. I'm not the best at editing, so I just do my best to. If we don't got a game here in the next ten seconds, I'll just wait until we get a game. That way, you guys don't have to. Okay. Oh, there we go. That. Let's see who we got. Okay. Joe, Scotty Barnes, Jimmy, St Steph, and Zach. I'm not even scared of this team at all. My team, I already know my team is better. I mean, Jimmy's good. You just got to, like, and then he got the other, he got the wrong Curry, so. I have the better Curry. Unless he had Del Curry on the bench, I should be chilling. Because watch call it gonna lock that up. So let's see. Yeah, he don't even got a bench like that. I mean, he got jaw, but other than that, I'm chilling. I ain't tripping. Kawhi gonna lock up Jimmy. Pau Gasol, like, is gonna tower over Scotty, and Joe's not gonna be able to do anything other than rebound and play interior defense. Uh, I'm keep up. So I usually turn it off. I don't know why. So let's see. They're usually gone before the first half when I play. That's what it usually is in the beginning of draft mode. Like last year, that was what it was like. I created my team to do XP, and it's just legit. It was gone within the first half, no later than the third, unless it was. Like, yeah, this one didn't play. So Philadelphia will get the first possession. Like you get penalized, you have to sit for like 15 minutes after the first time. Now like here's Curry. Sit for 30. And then after that, you have to sit for 60. And if you do it the fourth or the three, you have to sit for like 60 minutes. Tries again. Here's Barnes. All he's good for is rebound. And Embiid with the block. Incredibly light-footed at seven feet tall. MB can cover a lot of ground defensively. Yeah. Oh. Curry oh, can't get it to go. They're really holding down today. Fires the three. It's just forcing it. Rebound, Brooklyn. And Zach Levine gets the whistle that time. Zach Levine. That is his first foul of the game. First foul. First team foul. No one near Curry as he lets it go. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Nice feed that time from Leonard. Anytime Curry gets a look from deep, he's letting it fly. And he's probably knocking it down, too. Here's Barnes. Gasol with the rebound. And so Gasol will bring it up for Brooklyn. It's a three-point game. Away team foul. And the call on Zach the Levy. shot that sends him to the Second line. Personal foul. Kevin, what's so Second impressive to me about the game? It, it, it's it's the all-around all play that affects the game and across the board. And Levine's efficient as well. And, and good shooting numbers, no <laughs> doubt. Last year he cut the ball. Oh, he still did his personal foul. First team foul. First time for the free throw line for him in this one. Jimmy Butler. Jimmy Butler's work ethic is really impressive. I mean, it seems like he never stops improving his game and looking for ways to be more effective on the floor. And that's why he's been as good as he's been so far in this career. We'll get right back to the action when we return. This one has been one-sided so far. Away to your foul. And we'll get a I think it's because I'm in a party. Look at how the hustle stand first team foul. I don't know if you're first team foul. You have to give them credit for their defense here in the early stages. I mean, they've shown tremendous anticipation on the same page as a unit defensively, especially on those block shots. Trying to get three. I already got Brooklyn leading by 11. Right side, Kirk. I'm deep. And 
Philadelphia grabs the miss. Not sure why he keeps trying his luck from deep here. It's just not his night. Outside Gasol. Launches a three. Missed that one. Still right looking three. for a shot. Just two for four. nine. Philadelphia trails by 11. Curry with it. Guarded now by Irving. And Stephen Curry gets the three. Curry's got 10 points in the game. I'm not called for Philadelphia. I mean, what can we say about Stephen's jump that had already been slapped? And Philadelphia decides to take their first timeout right here. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. So. Quarter number two with just over a minute gone. And here's Levine. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Stephanie Curry. And the basket by Curry. You know, Zach Levine is not just a scorer. He's really good at setting up his teammates, too. From deep. Curry shot is off. Philadelphia trails by 11. Never going to take that Curry on the wing. Three pointer. It's not going to go for him. And Brooklyn will now go the other way with it. Led by as many as 14 points. Well, I tell you what, Curry is such a tremendous perimeter shooter that I think his ability to set up teammates and his unselfishness are often underrated. Here's Curry with the three. Curry with another miss. Brooklyn leading by 13. Two minutes remaining. Pulls up on the way. Two minutes. And it's Brooklyn Stop scoring the game. The assist was a great goal. Right so gifted at getting the ball all over to the open knee. Curry outside. Jimmy Butler with the rebound. The only way I can score right now. Good job. Well, most games he can knock it down from deep, but it just isn't there for him in this one. 136 left in the first half. And Levine throws it down. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm Levine, one of the very I'm best high players in the league, showing you the elevation right there. I'm thinking for my next. Here's Levine. Uh, no set trying to get open. My next. Levine uh, can't hit. Hey guys, how about the dominant young career? How many challenges has yet? Very few can dominate like he can, Kevin. Towns is a team Averaging a double every year of his career personal. so far. So second valuable in what he brings to the table. Substitution on the court. Here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. Curry shot is off. Here in the second quarter, he's been cold from distance. I think he may need to adjust his approach. And that's a last ball out here while we're taking possession. Like, I'm legit surprised he hasn't left yet, to be honest. 56 seconds left to play in the first half. To the middle. Here's Blackman. Rolando first shot, Blackman. first pass. He's out of the box fast. The D can't allow Blackman to get deep inside because he knows what to do when he gets there. Curry deciding where to go with it. Another miss by Curry. There's some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's equally good at guarding against him. Yeah. That time showing off the creativity. Back to Beal. Over to the wing. The three from Morant. That does not fall. Still looking for his first basket after three shots. And the chip by Levine. It's such a He's smart so pass so from Curry. There isn't much this the guy can't do with the ball the in his hands. So he sees the whole court. So that's the first I'm half. I'm going to the first half. I'm going to the first half. I'm going to the first half. And after a very long side first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. Exactly. 
Brooklyn leading by 19 points. Levine double team. Looks for ball. Hands it to him. That's like, that's not, like two points. are so overpowered in this game. Well it's actually an effort, and, and they show no signs like, of letting up. All Jordan, almost I mean, no holes in their performance, their performance tonight. tonight. Like to watch They've been tremendous. Not once have I ever seen it. It's three like outside. Not once. You know, he's just not taking good shots, not taking smart shots, forcing up a lot of low percentage jump there. And there was a foul that goes on Jimmy Butler. First team foul. That is his first foul of the game. Levine wide open. And again, Brooklyn converted. So true. Levine, a primetime threat to knock down those mid-range jumpers. Pass to Levine. And this is the perfect moment. Love three. Like, I mean, it's rebounded by Towns. Well, he's got a great stroke. That one almost dropped. The open shot. Levine. Levine. And it's Brooklyn scoring again. Boy, how about Levine he's cooking exactly these defenders? He's a lot of fun to watch. Lever, I don't care. The kick outside okay, to I'm, Butler. I'm Back to Barnes. The shot misses. Ice team from now, Levine. And so Gasol will bring it up for Brooklyn. They lead by the biggest mm -hmm. margin of the game, 25. Basketball. And Levine puts it down. Hey, whatever adjustments they made at halftime, they are working to perfection. You know, they came out of the locker room, revved up the gas pedal, and haven't slowed down yet. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold stream. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot making is not happening right now. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun yeah, right now. Yeah, offensively, they've just been rolling. Impossible to stop. And this offense is in a perfect rhythm. And you can see how they're finishing their plays. Boy, this is borderline ridiculous. I mean, every single attempt finding the bottom of the bucket. Here's Paul. Away team foul. Shooting foul. Stephen As the whistle Curry. blows, he'll Three shoot two free throws. Foul. Second team foul. Against Stephen Curry. Oh, oh. The craftiness of Paul. Really on display Chris everywhere, Paul. but especially inside and forcing defenders to commit fouls. <laughs> nice ball movement by Brooklyn. Oh. Levine. Oh. A Two free throws foul. coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Carroll. First personal foul. Levine showing you good effort that time, foul. not allowing the foul to stop him from getting shooting the shot off. Brooklyn. The first one falls. Levine. So both teams making Taking some changes here. And so Levine nails both of them. That Levine is so good, man. It's like Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. Like it's not even funny at this point. Outside Beal. Pass to Irving. Can they get it? Gets it to go Irving. from beyond the arc. Three points. Irving's got himself on the board with three there. And the confidence Irving has is, is something I really appreciate. I mean, he's ready to shoot it as soon as he gets it. And not afraid of any kind of shot. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Back to Irving. Fires from deep. Another three for Philadelphia. The fire that Irving plays with happens. I mean, you can feel it. When you make a three on him, it's payback time. He's coming at you. I think he's really trying to come back at Like he's not down 30. Outside Curry. Yeah, he's trying to come back at I'm lagging again. Off the mark there with the three point shot. Try to get these three Here's Philadelphia. Here's Beal. A finish. Irving showing you he's a frame ahead of his opponent with that nice imagination. Unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct. So here we are. We're about to get. We got 11 picks. Trying to get. Diamond Lamar Odom. And he's randomized for the most part. Seems like we're just getting a bunch of MT. Let's go back to the top. Five hundred again. I 
I'll take that. We'll stick to this side. Shoe boost. Okay. Three tokens, I'll take it. I didn't expect to get in here. It's based on luck. Can we just do six tokens? I'll take it. We tried. I mean, it was for fun. Oh, they did that? You had 21 MT is after a lot if you think about it. But we hit 25. We got 10 tokens now. We got what? About what? 3? 4K MT? Alright. Still on cool. And that's it. I mean, we can hop into the offline to get 2 XP. But our main focus is going to be doing this. So I think we're going to hop in a domination game. And then hop in some. TTO or clutch uh, time offline. God, my words. And then this is all we got. I mean, we're just saving up MT for the most part until we want to get a player we actually like. So we want like Kobe or something. We already have her. Just quick selling. Let's hope we can get a uh, historical thing without duplicates. I'm pretty sure if, yeah, we might play some TT, a clutch time offline. Oh, we get three pacers. Okay, not bad. But yeah, for the most part, we're chilling right now. Then just collect. I'm, I, that's another thing I hate. They they don't count this in the these stuff in the, this stuff in the collector level. It has to be all players. Like it can't be nothing else other than players. So the collect level is going to be a lot slower this year. Let's see if this is good for anything. No. Cause usually this stuff goes or stuff. I I was checking yesterday. I sold one of my uh, Bulls jerseys yesterday. And it went for like 5k. I ended up just putting it for a snipe. But, but yeah, see that's 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 a little bit empty. That's the main thing I've been selling. Put that up for 950. I'm not using them, so no point in having them. I'm not doing. I don't. Main collector level I'm going for is the players collector collect level. It's 850. So I just put these two up for a thousand. So that's really much it. I mean, like I said, we'll probably by tomorrow after school, or probably tonight, I probably will have both of those players. Because if we're correct, we get the 20 wins, which we only need 5. 20, yeah. That would be 35. So yeah, I'll be able to get both of them and have 5 uh, tokens left. So yeah, then after that, we'll just start tomorrow. And you know, uh, hop into clutch down. So, not clutch down. I mean, if we get a hundred wins in clutch down, it will be nice. But it's like, dude, I'm not trying to sit in that. I don't even have a good shooting guard. Now that I think about it. I mean, I got two in front there. Sorry about that. Had a little interruption. Uh, so this is with the team I will rock with. Giannis. I can't run quite at the two, so. Which well indeed. I mean, this is what I will rock. Just until I get uh, Donovan Mitchell and Derrick Rose. Because I really have I mean, there's no shooting guards in the game that's actually good. Like, Rubies. Del Curry's not good unless you have his Evo. I don't, at least I don't think so. Small four is like. Is there any Amethyst shooting guards? Small forwards. Like, Grant, yeah, like, there's so many cards in the game. Like, so. And that's the problem. Expensive. So, yeah, I think that's it for, t for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.
piece. Oh, that's one thing I forgot. One more thing before we leave. Uh, I put a couple days, about a half a week ago, I put this in, so let's collect this. It's just an option pack. I don't, I forget what's in it. I think it's just three, three agents, and then it helps collect all. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up Larry Bird. Is that, well, I could have picked up Patrick Young, it didn't matter. I didn't have any of those guys. But yeah, so I, this is the outro. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, co comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.